Howdy, Possum Patty and the Soggy Bottom Bunch over here. Yeppers, a mess on the desk, and the journal that I'm playing in. Yes, <laughs> for No Stress November, because this journal is just a lot of fun. Anything goes in this journal. I just, it's just a cosmic smash of so many different things. Yes. <laughs> well, I came in and I sat down. And I was like, hmm. What should I journal about today? So what I did was actually put some hand cream on because I just washed the dishes and I'm just sitting here and thinking and I'm looking at the journal and it popped into my mind that I had not yet journaled about the Big E exhibit that I want to put in here. The Big E is the New England Exposition. New England States Exposition. <laughs> it's a long name, so we just call it the Big E. And it's like a giant state fair for all the New England states to have together. And there's a state house for each of the states. And I live in Connecticut. And the Connecticut house has finally, after years and years and years and years, <laughs> changed its exhibit. And it put in an exhibit called Love You to the Moon and Back. <laughs> Love you to the moon and back. And I loved it. Yes. And Stanley loved it. Flat Stanley loved it too. Well, it had an exhibit of spacesuits. Why? Because, and I didn't know this. It's learned something new every day, right? Hmm. Yeah. Every NASA astronaut that ever walked on the moon was wearing a spacesuit made right here in Connecticut. And I was like, wow, I didn't, I didn't know that. I never heard that before. Yes, yeah, so every astronaut, NASA astronaut that walked on the moon was wearing a spacesuit made right here in this state. Well, it had a funny little spacesuit for the kids, but I took my picture. <laughs> I took my picture in the spacesuit. So I printed that out and it's over here somewhere. Oh, here it is. <laughs> I printed that out. Oh, and of course, Flat Stanley had to get his picture in the spacesuit too. <laughs> oh, I hear you, Stanley. Stanley's yelling down from the shelf up there that I need to do some journaling in his journal because yeah, I have a lot of pictures of Flat Stanley on adventures, but you know what, Stanley? <laughs> He's laughing up there. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna work on this journal and finish this up. Yeah. And then I'll get to your journal and the fairies have journaling. Everybody has journaling, and that's okay. It's no stress November. Yes. So I'm ignoring all the voices in the background and just playing in this journal. Well, it's getting late. It's past the morning devil clock. So y'all better come on along. So I picked out a very large page here. This is one of my Franken pages where you just take a bunch of different paper and sew it together to make a larger piece of paper. <laughs> you can add ribbon or do whatever you want. And yeah, I want this large page and I love this paper. But the problem is, yeah, it's, it's like a foil. So it's really hard to get things to stick to it. The back is fine. I can glue this down, no problem. But it's you know, glues just don't stick to it because it's foil. So I really, really, really want to put this this picture on the front, but I want to cut it. And I want to take out some of this background here. and put it in like a tuck. But I'm thinking <laughs> it's not gonna stick. Do I need to sew it? That's the only thing that really works with this foil paper. I'm trying to determine what's the, uh, the helmet, what's the background here. 
Okay, I think that goes like this, yeah. There. I love it to the moon and back. <laughs> oh, I could take it to the sewing machine, right? And just run a stitch here and here, just like that, and then glue the whole thing down. And then I don't think there'll be any problems. Then I'll just have to make a journaling card and do a little journaling. And that might be it. Oh, I have some stickers here. I got some planets. I got some astronauts in space there. I got a little alien. Yeah, I like this. It's like a Buck Rogers uh, spaceship. I could put a few things on there, maybe. They'll stick. <laughs> They'll stick. Or I could just leave it like this. I kind of, I kind of love this. All right, I gotta get going because it is late. So I'm gonna dash over to the sewing machine, sew these two sides, and I'll be right back. I'm back. Yes, just a straight stitch, simple, up and down, around the corner, and done. I was just fascinated by this spacesuit. And Yeppers, I took this picture because if you look in the reflective shield on the helmet at that lady right there with the pink hat holding up her phone, mm -hmm, there's Possum Patty. <laughs> okay, now I have to glue this down. And let's see, this is pretty thick. This is pretty heavy. Oh, I might just do my double whammy like I always do. You know, I was going through that pile on the table. I was looking for these stickers. And it was like, oh man, I wanted to put this in a journal. I wanted to put that in the journal. And... I found like half a dozen things already sitting there that I could journal about. You know, and these are things that have already happened that just, you know, the stuff is just sitting there waiting. So I'm sure I'm going to have no problem filling up this journal with these things and make sure I got enough around the edge because this is pretty heavy. And those are things I already want to journal about and not even things, you know, that haven't happened yet. Okay, I thought I measured this. <laughs> I thought I measured this. It's a little bit larger than I thought. That is okay. I'm just taking the glue. All that extra glue I put on the edge, I have to take off now because it's overhanging a little bit. Come on, stay down, stay down. Oh, did I just smooth that glue? <laughs> I smoothed the glue on my shiny background. All right, let's move on. <laughs> Moving on, let that dry. This is another thing I pulled out and obviously I pulled it out because it was green and gold. I don't know if you can see there. Just a gel plate print with some green and gold paint. And I believe the background is just like pieces of grass, you know, with the fluffy ends with all the uh, seeds on it. And let's see, it's like the perfect size for that pocket, but it's kind of thin and I, I want something on the back. And I don't want to use that foil. But I want to stick to this theme, this green and gold. And 
And so I've got my picture and I've got stickers and I've got, I've got, <laughs> I've got, oh, here it is. <laughs> I've got, love you to the moon and back. But what do I put on the back? Oh, my stars. All right, let me find something. Back to the shelf. How about some gold, gold glitter paper? And this is by Jot Glitter Paper, which means it comes from the Dollar Tree. I am just so happy, so happy to be using up these supplies. Yes. And it is actually sticky paper but I might add a little extra glue to the back of this first. And then I'm gonna stick that paper on, and maybe rip, I don't know if I could rip it, try to rip it or cut it around the edge. And maybe I can get some stickers to stick to it with a little extra glue maybe. Oh, you know what? I can't do that because I have to cut out a piece. I cut it a little larger. Hopefully I have a little overlap. You usually find the jot papers over in the stationery department, not the craft department. Because it's plasticky, I didn't know if it would rip or not. Yeah, it might work. Let's see. I'm following the edge of the green paper. That's good. Save the scraps. And I'm gonna put this back in here so I remember what that was. Okay, I think the first thing I'm going to do is put the picture and the little stamp that says love you to the moon and back and do a little journaling around here. And then do I want to put the stickers on this side or that side? Hmm. Okay, I'll do this and be thinking about that. Love you to the moon and back and the big E 2024 I put on the moon. <laughs> After many, many years, the Connecticut house has changed its exhibit. Every astronaut that has ever walked on the moon has worn a spacesuit made here. What if, what if I put a little green moon? Look, it's green and gold. Green and gold, put it right up there in the corner. Add a little fabric tack. Oh yes, and before I glued down Love You to the Moon and back, I took this Deco Color Premium Gold Pen by Marvy Paint Pen. And I put a little gold border around the stamp there. And as you can see, I smudged it because <laughs> I picked it up and I wanted to measure where to put the picture. But that's okay. It is still possum perfect, which means just a little wonky. Okay. I love that side. Now we have a plain gold side here. 
Uh, should we play with stickers? What should we do? Do we want astronauts, rocket ships, planets, aliens? You know me, I'd go with the alien. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Some of these are like doubles. Okay. Doubles, doubles, doubles. Well, we got a colorful planet here. Colorful planet. I'm just going to lay them down, see if they stick. Going to do a little audition here. We can do like an alien. We can do like a rocket ship. Use them up. Why not? <laughs> All right. So we can have the alien up there. We can have the USA down there. We can have the astronaut here because the little alien's waving like he's waving at the astronaut who's out in space. Now that's the same planet. Mm. Oh, we could put the moon. So the astronauts are in the spaceship and they were going to the moon when they encountered an alien. So he decided to take a spacewalk and check him out. <laughs> yeah, let's just fill up the page. Put little gold stars everywhere. Well, maybe that's the moon and maybe that's a planet. I don't know what planet that would be. So if that's a planet, then we could put the, it looked like moon with the craters on it, but maybe it's not. Where did it go? <laughs> Where did it go? Oh, jumped over there. Okay. And put some stars. I heard they were going to hold a congressional meeting in Washington, D.C. about UFOs. And that that's coming up pretty soon. I mean, how appropriate is this, right? <laughs> There's my little UFO. Use them up, use them up, use them up. The alien's got three antennae and one giant eyeball. I would love to know the secrets that the uh, government is keeping from people about UFOs, because <laughs> I'm sure there is some. Okay, <laughs> I think we did pretty good there. Now these aren't sticking down very well, so I am putting a little bit of glue on the back. And we'll see if they stay in place. Some of them are coming off like they were like little window clings or something. Like not sticking at all. But that's okay. So let that dry. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they're going to take a while to dry on there. And my journaling card. So sparkly and fun. Look at the little alien. He's waving. <laughs> awesome Patty in a little astronaut space suit there. And my shiny astronaut page. So this will just go in here. Love you to the moon and back like that. <laughs> well, I'm going to give these stickers a few more minutes to dry. I can feel the glue still a little tacky especially up in the corner there, before I put them into my astronaut tuck. Yes, a little bit of journaling and a whole lot of fun <laughs> for my no stress journal sesh today for no stress November. Yes, I love this possum patty 
reflection in the gold shield on the helmet. <laughs> learn something new every day. Yes, learn something new every day. And yeah, thanks for coming along today and happy junk journaling. Bye-bye.